The town of Renfrew passed its budget proceedings at the recent meeting of council, and I caught up with Mayor Don Eady to talk about the upcoming year. One thing council did go ahead with is a 10-year forecast, which the mayor believes will give them more insight at what work will need to be done in the years to come and plan accordingly. Well, the first, the most important part to me is that it streamlines our budget in that our capital part of it, and uh, we know now for 2019, uh, there's a million dollars plus whatever there, and 2020, there's a million dollars plus. So at the end of the day, uh, heads, of, uh, heads of our departments can go ahead. They can put their plan together. And if you're buying a new truck, you know how much money you have in two years, three years, or five years. So there's no surprises and there's no very, very little increase in the tax rate to make that all happen. Some of the major items to come up in this year's budget is the reconstruction of Ragland Street, the repairs to Barnett Boulevard, the second ice pad and recreation center, along with the designs and repairs to Stewart Street in the future. I don't think there's any big surprises. It's uh, at Plant Street, it's uh, Highway 60 Main Street, uh, Barnett Boulevard, uh, whatever. We're going to be doing the engineering this year on uh, Stewart Street uh, on the far end of town and hopefully maybe in 2019 be able to build that if, uh, if the government grant comes through. Other than that, I think it's all pretty, pretty stable. The town will also see a tax increase of 2%, which the mayor says is just the cost of inflation, much like everything else. 2% is almost like a 0% tax increase in one way because we have to we have to live with a rate of inflation. And that's with your own home, that's with business, etc. So we have to live with that. And so we're, our gearing is to try and stay around that 2% level at all times that we possibly can. Reporting for Kojiko News here in the town of Renfrew, I'm Richard Leroy.